And um, what is going on, people? Welcome to Wolfie Park Games. And as you can see, once again, we are playing Game Dev Tycoon. Although you will notice, I am not the previous person who was doing this. Um, this is because the two p the two owners of this page are kind of competing on this game, <laughs> um, which means that you'll have two separate games of the same game, essentially. Two separate, I'll say, carriers. <laughs> but the, the only problem with this is the fact that the other owner of this page has played this game and I have not, <laughs> which is delightful. Company name, um, um, look about me room. Oh no, this is gonna be called Dugsy Games. <laughs> well, I'm gonna sneeze. Play it. TNG Female apparently, I don't know why. Oh, I'm not. <coughs> <laughs> oh, Christ. I think it's the first video I've sneezed in, surprisingly. Even though I do it a hell of a lot. Right, we're just gonna be. I think that's an Asian person, so. Oh, no. No, we're gonna be that one. He's gonna wear. Oh, that straight we jump will look damn sexy, eh? Like. Yeah, hell yeah, slightly jumper. Um, <laughs> achievement unlocked. Support a young star. Okay. Oh my no. Ooh, develop again. Before development can begin, you have to decide what kind of game you want to create and give your game a name. That is. Your options are initially eliminated. Eliminated. <laughs> Limited. Um, right then. Pick topic. We're gonna have. So we're gonna have a sports game. Um, sports RPG. <laughs> um, sports simulation. Peak platform. Um, market share. G64. So we will have PC. Game will be called. Um, game will be called. Doug's Esports, just for the lols. Doug's Esports! Graphics. 2D graphics. There we go. Hmm. Game development runs through three stages at the beginning of each stage. Dev! Is that the same? Is this made by the company who make the actual dev? C++ I think it is um, quarter on. I was thinking that earlier but um, anyway <laughs> off on a tangent but right then think about what areas are important for your game nice one um, um, gameplay not much story So engine's gonna help a lot. Game development has now started. Good. While developing your game you will generate game points which you can see bubbling up. Oh nice. From time to time there will also be bug points generated. These points become less likely once you gain experience. Nice one. Ooh, two bugs. Three bugs. But at least there's a lot of design. Development stage two. Artificial intelligence up. Level design up. Dialogue. Hmm. Not to bother about dialogues, that's it. Research, technology, bugs. Ooh, look at all these nice coloured ones. Boosh, 15 or so. During, during development, you can also select additional features for your game. Nice one. <laughs> that's a, that's the best way to go through tutorials. Just read the first line. You will also see the graphic type you selected when you define the game. Hmm. So what? What do? Graphics. Sound. And then world design can still see. I don't know what for me not if it's over. Um. So there's lots more bugs now, but never mind. 
we're getting lots of research. The development of your first game is now complete. You can press finish. Without fixing bugs, can survey it. Right. How do you fix bugs? Oh, wait, it just does it for you. <coughs> um, no fans. Finish. The moment of your game is now finished, while developing games you gain experience and improve skills. Nice one. New topic, new combo. Level. Gameplay. Story and quests. Dialogue. Awful thing is, that's my most important thing in a game, story. And it's one of the least. Oh Christ, look at all this. Release game. Might as well. Good judgment. Create a game with a good thing. Your game is not complete, and you and will be handed off to publishing. We see. We should see reviews and sales coming in from the game soon. You finished your first game. While you while you developed the game, you also gained right research points. Oh, that's what they were. I'm just like. I suppose they're just upgrade points, aren't they? Right. Um. Dogsy Sports. Um. Seven. Their focus on gameplay served this game very well. Six. Sports and simulation is a great combination. Nice experience. Game here. I got like a four. Yeah. Quirky but good. <laughs> and that's from Star Games, Informed Gamer, Game Hero, and all games. Hell yeah, like a boss. Dugsy Games, a newcomer in the game industry, has just released their first game, Dugsy Sports. <laughs> oh, the game received favourable reviews with such a good start. Dugsy Games are shooting the game fans quickly. How many fans have we got? Ooh. 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 Dugsy Sports sold 3,265 units in its first week on the market. We made it in the charts at, um, at 68. Half. Oh, 12 fans, really. No, <laughs> no, your game is on sale. You will receive income from the game every week. You can see how well your game is doing by. So I suppose you got lots of money. You'll be able to make um higher developed games. I suppose. It was so successful that we now. <laughs> oh yeah, that sounds like success. Twelve fans get in there soon. Any <laughs> um anyway, guys, I'm gonna end this episode here. I'm gonna. Straight away after after finishing this video, I will make another video because I have thoroughly enjoyed this experience so far, and I hope you enjoy watching it because it seems like a damn good game and I'm getting lots of money. So, um, thanks and goodbye. And we.